Hello everyone, my name is Jessica, if this is your first time, uh, welcome to my channel. On my channel, we make hair video, we make food video and so on. But today, we're going to be making food video. Yay! Food video. What we're going to make is um, African, what we're going to make is African snacks. And uh, we call it puff puff. And um, it's very easy and you need a, just a few ingredients to do this. You need oily flour, you need yeast, and you need um, vanilla extract and just oil few ingredients so the first thing i have to do is just put my floor i'm going to put my floor here i don't need too much floor it depends on the, the quantity of floor depends on the quantity of what you want so i just need this quantity of floor so i have my floor here my floor is ready the next thing I have to do is activate my yeast and to activate my yeast I just I put my yeast on, on a glass on a glass cup and, uh, and then I mix it with sugar this is sugar I miss I miss my my I mix it with sugar like I just take like two or three two and a half spoon and then this is lukewarm water, it's not very hot and um, not very cold. Lukewarm, we call it lukewarm water, warm water. And then I just add it to my yeast and mix. So this is how, if you want to activate your yeast, this is how you do it. So um, to make your puff, puff to like rise, these are you do it. Activate your yeast like this. This is the best way to activate your yeast. Lukewarm water, sugar, and your yeast, and then you mix it. And then you keep it for like five minutes to activate. Let's keep it for five minutes to activate. While we we waiting for her yeast to activate, then the next thing you have to do is put your vanilla extract, your vanilla flavor. To your floor, you mix all the dry ingredients together. Like I we always say, all you have to do is mix all your dry ingredients. This is my vanilla extract. It's vanilla extract. Mm, I love the perfume. It's just to give this. This is to give um, perfume to to your puff, puff. Then this is salt, guys. I have salt here. I just take just a little bit of salt and I add it to my floor okay so now my yeast has activated you see when you have the activated yeast this is what it comes it comes to add bubbles on top so the next thing we have to do is I'm going to add my floor here is my floor guys I'm going to add this to my mixer because I like to I like to use mixer to to mix my my dough. If you want to use just hands, if you don't like to use mixer, then you can just do it at mixer. But I like to use mixer. And then I'm going to add my yeast to my to my to my floor. I've added my yeast to my floor, and then I'll mix. And then you miss.
okay guys so i have my mist here and uh, you have to use your spatula to miss it this is what it looks like right now i want it to be a little bit thick high because it's not very thick right now so i'll just add some flour to it i want it to a bit to look a bit thicker and why i'm adding flour i'm missing with my spatula now let's go you can see it looks excuse me um i just have to miss it and uh, until it comes to be a little bit thicker and stashy you just have to be stashy so you have to miss it i need to add more flour What it looks like it looks stashy you can see it looks a little bit it looks stashy at this moment so the more you miss it the more stashy it becomes you just have to be stashy this is what you have to be you have to be stashy you can see the more stashy it's the more missing it the more you miss it the more it becomes stashy so now it's already stashy now i'm going to cover it for for 30 minutes or one hour i'm going to leave it for one hour and then we we'll go to the next step so guys this has actually last for 30 minutes i think it was 45 minutes i left it for 45 minutes this is what it looks like what it looks like damn wow this is what it looks like right now so now the next stage is to put it on hot oil we have to fry it right now I have finally finished frying my buffalo, my Nigerian snacks, these African snacks, Nigerian snacks precisely. And um, this is what it looks like right now. Like one ball is a ball. It looks nice. Wow. So guys, I would recommend you to do this um, because it's very easy. All you need, all you need is flour, yeast, um, yeast, and um, sugar then you can have the flavor of your choice any flavor you need you just add it to your choice um let me let me test it i just need to i need to let this is what this wow you can see uh mm. Mm. i told you because of the vanilla flavor that i had it mm. it had a, it has a very nice smell mm. This is nice and it's delicious. 
I did add it to, um, you can add anything you want, vanilla. Hmm. You can actually hit this with, you can, you can use it as breakfast. You can use coffee, you can use tea or anything, juice or anything. You can actually you use it as a snack as well. Mm. I love how it came out. Mm. This is delicious. I love it. Came out nice. Mm. Mm. Delicious. Hmm. This is nice. Try this at home. Try this at home. If if you have never tried it before, your kids, if you have kids, your kids will love this. Mm. Thank you very much for watching this video. And if you have not subscribed, please, please, please subscribe to my channel. And um See you on my next video. Bye.